What's good crypto family welcome to my channel once more it's your boy cousin here for another crypto video okay so today is the day 8 of my uh, pancake swap auto cake versus manual cake okay <clears throat> as you can see I've started to I've staked some cake so on the 22nd of June so I've staked uh, to 30 cakes on auto cake pool and 30 cakes on the manual pool okay just to do a comparison and see which one is best to um, stake cake so eight days later so today is the 30th I think yes today is the 30th so eight days later so the auto cake initially was a bit slow it was a bit behind uh, from the manual cake so but then eventually the auto cake managed to catch up and now as you can see so this one is 48663 486628 uh, 48, so that means the auto cake now is ahead okay so in the short term manual cake is good uh, th those 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 gonna be gonna be my thoughts in short term the manual cake is gonna be good but in the long run the auto cake is gonna be better okay because you know the auto cake will automatically compound the cake for you the the profit for you okay so this profit right here as you can see is already here okay so um that means this uh 106 apy is already been staking is already staking the profit plus the 30 cakes okay whereas the manual cake you know is only staking the 30 cakes okay so the profit is just laying there all right so in order to use the profit i will have to collect and then i will have to add to the stake okay until then the um, the manual cake will only stake the 30 cakes as you can see i've got 30 cakes here still and over here got 30 cakes plus point four eight six seven t okay um yeah so my thoughts about this uh auto cake and manual cake is that um yeah manual cake is good for the first five days but then um more than that i would go for the auto cake that's what i will do because um yeah in the long run it's more beneficial staking your cake in auto cake and also i've put some money so um so I've put some money on TUSD. Okay, it's, it's a stable coin. So I just got a few cakes. Well, not a few cakes, just a 0.2 cake here. Just to, you know, instead of having this cake laying around doing nothing, I'd rather put it, uh, put it somewhere where I can make some profit from it. And I've also yesterday, so I've, I've, I've joined um, a liquidity farm so this farm it was about 500 percent so i was like damn this api is really really high so i'm gonna put some some cake in it and let's see what happens well i'm gonna invest in this pool in this farm and let's see what happens so i've put some bnb and alpha and um let's see how's it doing so i've put um so alpha and bnb lp token okay so it's worth about $153 and is generating. So the APR is 337. So yesterday was 500 plus 520 something. But, you know, the more people join the liquidity, um, the lower will be the APR. OK, so, yeah. But, you know, so far, so good. You know, in one day, I already made uh, 166 dollars okay so that means um 0.123 cake all right so i'm gonna leave it here for now you know just i'm just trialing see see how it goes and um i might do a few other farms but who knows we'll see so yeah that's it guys today is just an update about how my uh, pancake swap doing you know and um slowly but surely um is growing uh my main goal now is to hit 100 cakes okay so my main goal now is to reach 100 cakes and i would like to produce one cake a day 
you know, if I can, if I get to the point where I can produce one cake a day, yeah, that would be good. And then from there, I will go to the next step. Okay, so my main two goals right now is to reach 100 cakes and produce one cake per day. All right. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope you guys have a better understanding now about the auto cake and uh, manual cake. So just to recap, in a short run, so up to five days, I would use the manual cake. So let's say, for example, you got, let's say, 100 cakes or 200 cakes or let's say 100 plus. All right. So 100 plus, you gonna generate a lot of cake in one day. Okay. So you probably every three to four days you would have to come here collect the cake and put the cake somewhere else or restake it you know but you know it's profited that way because you're not over here over here you will have um 288 uh uh so that means the the the, the, uh, the manual pull the auto pull is taking your cake 288 times a day okay so you're paying a fee every time this process happens whereas the the manual cake if you don't do anything you're not going to pay anything simple as okay so yeah up to five days i will use the manual cake and more than five days i would use the auto cake you know you, you cannot see a big difference now because i only got 30 cakes in each pool but uh, let's say if you have like 100 cakes or 200 cakes you know you will see the cakes piling up the profit piling up and uh eventually you would see a big difference okay just because my 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 cakes are, are small you, you don't see much of a difference but yeah hope you have a better understanding about the auto cake and manual cake which one is best in the short term and long term okay and uh yeah show workers in here hope you guys enjoyed the video i'm out